Hello parents, here I bring some new information that I have. Um, this is the school calendar for the year 2020-2021. So I know that a lot, of, a lot of people are still confused with the starting date of the school. This might answer all your questions. So the first day on the calendar is September 16th through the 18th. This will be <clears throat> this will be a test. This will be the starting date for the remote learning. So everyone will be in remote learning, including those in group A and group B. Uh, regardless of whatever group you're going to be in, don't worry about it right now. Just worry about what is the starting date. Well, whenever you know your group, then you know how to go about it. So the, September 16th will be the starting day for the uh, for everything. So we will start contacting all the students and teaching them about the platform and everything that we're gonna do. So now September 21st is the first day of school for in-person students for the blended model. So the first day on September 21st will be in group B. So if you are, if your teacher calls you and tells you that you are in group B, so you know that you're reporting on that Monday, the 21st. This is where everything starts. Now, if you are in group A, your first day will be that Wednesday, which is gonna be Wednesday, September 23rd. So that first week, group B will be Monday, Tuesday, Thursday. Group A will be Wednesday, Friday. Then the following week, uh, the, re the schedules will reverse. Now, this is something that might be a little confusion, confusing because the following week after the 21st is September 28th, and that Monday, which is supposed to be Group A, it, uh, the schools will be closed. We're celebrating uh, Yom Kippur, so the schools are gonna be closed. So then the next day will be the Tuesday, uh, September 29th, and that's the group A. And because everything switches, remember that the following week, then it's gonna be group B. So just everything that you have to pay attention to is that one group will be three days, one week, and then the following week, that same group will be two days and the group will alternate. So if we uh, keep on looking on the calendar, you see October 12th, the schools are gonna be closed. Uh, November 3rd is election day. Everybody's gonna be uh, in remote. So no matter what group you're in, that November 3rd, everybody's on remote. So then you have the parent-teacher conference for the elementary, and for us, middle school, parent-teacher conference will be here on November 12th. We're gonna be sharing the high school date. So 6th through 12th, it will be the parent-teacher conference uh, for our middle school, and also November 13th, which is a Friday. Remember that in our school, we always do the afternoon date, so most likely this day, will be a half a day, November uh, 13th, and we will do the parent-teacher conference that day. And we'll do both schedules, afternoon and, and evening. Now here it doesn't mention if it is a virtual or in person. That will be something that we will be talking about it later. Now you have here your Thanksgiving uh, date, which is gonna be November 26th and 27th. For the Christmas vacation, it's gonna be from December 24th through January 1st. Then January 18th will be Martin Luther King Day, always falls on a Monday. And then we have Lunar Day, February 12th. And then the vacation in February will be from February 15th through the 19th. We will give you this calendar and you, is, you could access it uh, at the Board of Education website. So another important day that I know a lot of parents follow for the vacation 
will be the spring recess will be March 29 through April 2nd. And the last day of school is going to be June 25th. Remember that we always have to do 180 days of school. So that's why the calendar varies a little this year. So you could, you'll be able to see this calendar is already out uh, by going to the webpage for the Board of Education, schools.nyc.gov. You can see it here. And you could do a search for 2021 school calendar. I will put a link on the description of the video. Thank you very much. Have a great day.